Hey, how's it going, everyone? Brick Cinema back with another uh, unboxing video here. This order is from Brick Tactical. Uh, this is actually my first order from Brick Tactical, so I'm pretty excited to get into this. Um, I only got a few things in this order. It's not not a big one or anything, but uh, I got some more stuff for some animations that I want to make. It's, I went ahead and already opened it up just to uh, save that time, but I like how the packaging has this nice little sticker on it. That's pretty nice. The other side is just the shipping label, which... I'm not going to show that, it just has my address on it. Alright, so inside, got this package, looks like some, uh, like a business card. Other side, that's a, just like the packing slip. So we got handwritten little thank you note and the list of the few things I got. Again, not too much, but let's go ahead and get this opened here. I do like how they put everything in this nice bag instead of like a bunch of tiny bags. So we got some extra bits in here. What is this? A business card. Custom only accessories printed on genuine Lego parts. All proudly made in the USA. Nice. We got more of these. Another business card. This one's just brick tactical. Nice. <clears throat> Excuse me. That's pretty cool. Yeah, I think. Is this a sticker? It is a sticker. Nice. I love when, uh, Stores like this give out free stickers. I just love getting free stickers. I have, uh, let me see if I, oh yeah, I do. See, I got the Citizen Brick one from a recent order as well. I don't know why, I don't really have a use for them, but it's nice getting them, so. This is kind of nice. It's in this, like, uh, plastic box thing. That's kind of nice. Instead of just a bunch of tiny bags. Looks like everything's in there. Let's get this opened up here. I guess we'll start off with these. So these are hoods. Um, not 100 percent sure how these go on the figure, but we'll figure that out. This one, I forget what this one's called. The camo on it is tan camo. That's what they call this. I wanted to pick up the brown one originally, but they didn't have any in stock. <clears throat> so I picked up one in this like olive drab, which actually looks really good, and then this one as well, which I also like. Um, I wanted to get some kind of alternative to the, like, actual Lego hoods, because they do, the style that I would want to get, um, <clears throat> for what I need them for, I believe the ones that are actually Lego, I mean, they're hard plastic, obviously, but I believe you can't really rotate the heads much, because I think they kind of have bits that overlap, like, onto the torso, um, and I don't have any to test, so I'd have to order them off, like, Bricklink or something, so I wanted to try these out first to see if these would be good for uh, what I want to do. So we'll test these out in a minute once I get the bodies out and everything. But these look pretty nice. I'm not going to lie. I like the uh, coloring on here. It's really nice. I ordered two of these. I think these are just called like check the thing again. World War II camo. Um, it's kind of, I don't know what camo exactly this is supposed to be. I'm not using it for a World War II film, but uh, it's the camo pattern that I kind of wanted to go with here. This zoomed in a little more. So these look really nice. This is, like I said, this is my first brick tactic order, so I wasn't entirely sure on the quality of the printing, but this is really nice actually. I like these. Printing looks really well done. I don't see any mistakes, at least none that catch my eye, so I'm really happy with these. Not too stiff too. A lot of I feel like a lot of figures, like I've ordered some from Brick Mania, and I feel like they're extremely stiff pieces, but these I mean that's not really, I don't think that's really their fault, but... Nice, so I ordered two of these. Um, so, both of them look pretty good. I'm gonna build, like, one of these into a figure in a second here. And then I got, last thing, I got two of these. If I can get them out. They're just little, I mean, they're cigarettes. That's what they are. Um, Overmolded cigarettes. I wanted to get these for, if it'll focus, some animations. Um, ordered two of these. So, I like how the orange bit on the ends kind of translucent. That's nice. Yeah. Overall, nice. Alright, let's try out one of these hood pieces. So, how do these go on here? I would assume. I'm assuming they all, all of these go on here, right? But it's probably. Okay. I just turned my computer on to go look at the image on the website, but I think I figured it out here. 
Although it is kind of awkward to get this on, I will say that. I don't want to like damage it. <laughs> now how do I get ahead on that? <laughs> Just let's see if that looks good. Oh, there we go. Yeah, I think that's maybe not a hundred percent right. Or oh, there we go. That looks kind of right, right? But it's not staying forward. I might not have it on correctly. I don't think I do actually, but. Real quick, this is me from the future here. I um, just wanted to show this. I got it on kind of more properly. Really just had to get those little parts out that were kind of stuck in on the sides. And yeah, so that's what it's supposed to look like. Overall, it looks pretty nice. I think this will work nicely for what I want to do because you can you know rotate it around all the way. So I think this will work nicely. So yeah, that is my order from Brick Tactical. We got two of these bodies, the hoods, a couple of these uh, cigarette pieces, make him hold these because I don't want them rolling everywhere. So yeah, overall, camera will focus, there we go. Overall I'm satisfied with these. Um, I do like the hoods. I kind of wish they would have had them in stock in brown, but they did not. And I think these camo figures will do nicely for what I want to do. So overall, um, good experience with them. They shipped really quick. So yeah, uh, I got some more of these unboxing videos coming up as soon as things start to show up again. Um, so thanks for watching, and I'll see you all in the next one.